Good morning. Today we are going to discuss a chapter of class 11 biology that is biological classification which is chapter number 2. We are going to look at some classifications of kingdoms given by philosophers and different scientists then. So two kingdom classification was given by Aristotle, while three kingdom classification was given by Ernst Haeckel, four kingdom classification was given by Herbert F. Copeland, five kingdom classification was given by R. H. Whittaker, and lastly, the six kingdom classification was given by Karl Puis. Aristotle's two kingdom classification includes Plantae and Animalia, while Ernst Haeckel's three kingdom classification includes Plantae, Animalia with Protesta. Copeland's Four Kingdom classification includes Plantae, Animalia, Protesta, and Monera. Whitaker's Five Kingdom classification includes Plantae, Animalia, Protesta, Monera, and Fungi or Fungaida. And Carl Woo's Six Kingdom classification includes Plantae, Animalia, Protesta, Archaebacteria, Eubacteria, and Fungi or Fungiida. So here is a table for you all, which is quite handy as I suppose, uh, which has members uh, of five kingdom, Monera, Protesta, Fungi, Plantae and Animalia, um, uh, portraying the clear distinction of uh, cell type, cell wall, nuclear membrane, body organization and mode of nutrition as well. Hope this helps you all. So here we have criteria for five kingdom classification in the form of bullets that include cell structure, thallus organization, mode of nutrition, reproduction and phylogenetic relationships. Phylogenetic relationships and evolutionary relationships are the same. Monera is a kingdom that includes a single cell organisms such as bacteria which don't have any uh, true nuclear membrane. Uh, moreover, uh, they are uh, prokaryotic in nature. And uh, Monera is a taxon which was uh, proposed by... So under Kingdom Monera, we have bacteria as the sole members of this kingdom. Um, and uh, the members of Kingdom Monera, they live in extreme habitats which uh, may include places like hot springs, deserts, um, snow deserts or snow or deep oceans and Kingdom Monera itself is grouped under four categories um, which include spiral, caucus, rod shaped bacillus, coma shaped uh, vibrium, spiral, spirillum. Okay, this uh, four categories of uh, Kingdom Monera which is grouped upon is uh, based on the shape of the bacteria. Bacteria as a group show the most extensive metabolic diversity. They may be photosynthetic, autotrophic or chemosynthetic, autotrophic. Major so now we'll be looking into Archaebacteria which are a special form of bacteria. As they live in uh, extreme um, uh, conditions like salty areas called as halophiles or hot springs called as thermoacidophiles or marsh areas called as methanogens they differ from other bacteria because they have a different uh, cell wall structure and this feature that is different cell wall structure is responsible for their survival in extreme conditions like salt areas hot springs or marsh areas Methanogens are present in the guts of the cows and buffaloes and are responsible for the production of methane from the dung of these animals. U bacteria are also called as true bacteria. The meaning of U is true just as pseudo is false. Uh, the U bacteria are called as true bacteria due to the presence of the rigid cell wall which is also one characteristic feature of U bacteria. And cyanobacteria are photosynthetic autotrophs because they can prepare their food by their own. They are unicellular, colonial and are surrounded by gelatinous sheath and they may be freshwater or marine. Um, and specialized cells which fix atmospheric nitrogen are called as heterocells. These are present in um, bacteria like nostoc and anapena. Chemosynthetic autotrophs oxidize various inorganic substances like nitrates, nitrites, ammonia and use the released energy for their uh, ATP production. This is an image of filamentous blue green algae which is nostoc. The blue beads, uh, the blue dots I mean surrounding the green beads is called as mucilaginous sheath 
and the dark and uh, blue uh, beads in between uh, surrounded by the green beads are called as heterocysts they are cells which fix a uh, nitrogenous atmosphere and are present in uh, bacteria like nostoc and anabena heterotrophic bacteria are included under u bacteria Heterotrophic bacteria are important decomposers which help in making curds from the milk, the production of antibiotics and also in the fixation of atmospheric nitrogen in uh, legume roots. U bacteria are reproduced mainly by fission and uh, spores are the structures that are produced uh, under unfavorable uh, conditions in bacteria and also in organisms such as fungi or fungi and mycoplasma are one kind of u bacteria which completely lack cell wall are the smallest living cells and they can survive without oxygen